Hello guys, in this video we will see how to download and install IntelliJ IDEA on Windows 11 operating system. The process is same for all Windows operating system. So search for IntelliJ download. Okay, click on download IntelliJ IDE. See here we have the IntelliJ IDEA Ultimate, but this is not free. This is for 30 days trial period, but for free we have to go to down see. We have the IntelliJ IDEA Community Edition. This is completely free. Okay. See here we have three types of downloads. EXE, ZIP and EXE ARM64. So select EXE then click on download. See download has been started and its size is 568 megabytes. Wait until this download completes. See here IntelliJ the leading Java and Kotlin IDE that is integrated development environment. Okay. Also see here the benefits. It is most advanced editor, deep coding understanding, collaborative and remote out of the box experience. Okay. See this is the console. Go to downloads. See download has been completed. Click on IDE 2024 EXE. Click on it. Click on next. See this is the destination folder. If you want to change you have to click on browse and you have to change. Space required is this is the space required. Okay. Click on next. If you want to create desktop shortcut, you have to click on. If you want to update context menu, you have to click on, you have to select this one. If you want to add bin path, you want to add. So, but it requires restart. So, I am not going to. If you want to add extensions, select them. Later also, we can edit. See, Gradle, Groovy, KT, that is Kotlin, KTS, Palm. So, click on next. Click on, see, this is the start menu folder. So, if you want to give the other you can go manually so click on next that is install see installation has been completed successfully if you want to open you have to click on this checkbox otherwise uncheck it and click on finish now go to start then search. see here we have the IntelliJ IDA community edition or you can search here also Intelli so click on IntelliJ IDEA Community Edition. Now click on I confirm that I have read and accept the terms of this user user agreement. Then click on continue. If you want to send the information, send anonymous statistics. But I don't want so click on don't send. Maximize it. If you want to install Java JDK, download and install Java JDK by going through the link provided in the video description and install it. Okay, click on new project. I am giving here, here we have, we can select the type of projects, okay, empty project or Groovy, or Kotlin or Java, okay, so I am giving first project, first Java project, then provide the location, this is the location it is going to store, okay, then build system, you can select any one of them, default it has selected, IntelliJ, okay want to create git repository you can select it here if you want to add the sample code you can select it advanced options see here this is the module name this is the content root okay this is the file name so if you want to change you can change click on create let me maximize expand source main see this is the sample code okay see this is going to print numbers from 1 to 5 Select the code and click on this run button. See now it is building. See we got the output. This is the output and this is the one i equals to one. See whatever here is there it is printed. Or else see, we can create your own Java file. Click on Java class. Then R2 schools. Hit enter. Now you can provide your code here replace this with this code then select it and compile it see we got the welcome to after school the same way if you want to add one more line copy it paste here remove this one and add the two numbers so it will print the sum of those two numbers select the text and click on this build or compile so see here we got the output 17 okay so in this video, we have seen how to download and install IntelliJ IDEA 
how many iteration on Windows 11 operating system. Then we have seen how to run the sample Java programs. For more Java videos, please subscribe my channel. Thank you.